Happy New Year. Welcome to my weekly roundup of what I've been up to in Hackney and Westminster. Well, Parliament returned this week and I was able to challenge the Prime Minister directly about the shortage of lateral flow tests in Hackney and nationally. Despite eight questions from opposition MPs, he couldn't answer the question, but we know what the problem is. He urged everyone to get tested and then didn't make sure there was enough supply or the logistics to get tests to the right place. So it's welcome that key workers are going to be prioritised, but it should never have come to this. I urged the Education Secretary this week to look again at school funding. Too often, COVID measures are funded in the very short term, but schools are expected to pay for them on an ongoing basis out of their existing budgets. And these budgets have been squeezed so that the pips squeak over the last decade. Our children have suffered enough. We need to make sure that they're not squeezed financially, schools, so that they actually damage children's education anymore. The government finally unveiled its Afghan citizen resettlement scheme this week. Uh, This is welcome, though I will be looking closely at the detail. But I'm very concerned about people already here, refugees living in what are called bridging hotels, supposed to be short term, but still there months after the fall of Kabul. The government has got to step up. It also needs to revisit the rules on family reunion for families from Afghanistan, many of whom have got family members here in Hackney, able to support them. But imagine the hurdle, for example, of the English language test. You try learning English under the Taliban. The government has really got to rethink this. Omicron is serious, but if you've had your vaccine, it's less likely that you'll go to hospital with it. So please do get vaccinated. Visit one of our fantastic community pharmacies, which have really stepped up, or go to one of the two main vaccination centres, which is where you must go if you're aged 12 to 15. And you can walk in to any of these places and get a jab. There are plenty of vaccines, so please get vaccinated.